You waste your time feeding your ego through meaningless sex with degenerate women. You aren't living in abundance and you don't have the confidence to feel good without proving yourself to other people. You feel approval once you're shown interest by another woman and more approval when you two have sex. And you end up feeling like a man for a few hours because a woman who also has low confidence had sex with you so she could feel good about herself. Casual sex makes you a degenerate and the scumbag methods that you use will only attract degenerate women, which is nothing at all to be boastful about. Casual sex is no better than porn. Porn is you watching random people have meaningless sex. Casual sex is you participating in meaningless sex. And if there's no meaning in it, then why do it? People who have casual sex boast about their numbers and act like they will stop having casual sex once they tick off everything that they want to do. And there's a very small chance that this will actually happen. And they are more likely to develop a sex addiction, which will lead down to depressed life. Like the Bob Marley quote, Money is numbers and numbers never end. If it takes money to be happy, your search for happiness will never end. And in the same way, because there's no limit to how many women you can have sex with, there will never be a time where you stop and say to yourself, oh, I've had enough. And it's the same way there's no limit to how many porn videos you can watch. You never hear people who watch porn say that once they've watched everything that they want to watch, they will stop. They will keep watching porn until they die or until they realize how sad their life is. And in the same way, you will continue to have casual sex until you die or until you realize how depressed your life is. Even if the pleasure keeps diminishing more and more, and you'll keep trying to get more and more stimulation so that you can feel the same amount of joy that you had when you started having casual sex. If anything, casual sex is worse than porn. Since you need a woman to have casual sex with, it will often take lying and manipulation for you to get there, which only makes you break women's hearts and their trust. And no one else should have to suffer just because you're so desperate to come. It is the same principle as you stealing from other people for your benefit. Even if you genuinely need to steal from other people to help yourself. Helping yourself meant taking away from other people, which is of course extremely selfish. And even if it doesn't take lying or manipulation to have casual sex, you're only adding on to the modern masculinity crisis. By you chasing the next best woman that you see, instead of you chasing your purpose and becoming a real man, you end up wasting all of your time and energy to pursue meaningless sex, which has no limit to how much you can have. This leaves you living as a weak and feminine man. Leaves you without your purpose, which is often work, and the woman without her purpose, which is often family. Having an intimate partner makes you a better man. If you find the right woman, she will only support and push you. There will be no choosing between purpose and women. So not only will you be able to have consistent and passionate sex, you will also have someone who cares about you very, very deeply and who wants you to be the best version of yourself. And the women you have casual sex with will never care a thing about your life and will likely drain the life and energy out of you. And if you bring up the argument that having sex with the same person gets boring, getting bored of sex with the same person is only your fault. If it is getting stale and you don't like it, then it is up to you to think of something new to make it exciting again. And if you're only waiting for your woman to do something new and exciting while you do nothing, then what else can you expect besides your sex life getting boring? It is unmanly to give up and move on to the next best thing. It is masculine to fix problems and issues, especially ones to do with you and your personal life. If you dislike the sex that you and your woman are having, and you either cheat or leave, it is one of the most weak and feminine things that a man can do. A real man deals with problems, no matter how difficult and confusing they may be, stripping away all emotions that may get in the way and fixing things, like a real man, and reaping the rewards of loyalty, support, respect and gratitude from his woman, for all his effort and dedication towards her and their relationship.